the world famous bagel hall in Brooklyn, New York. The first thing I came to my mind was bagel chips. That's what it looked like to me. Years ago, we used to take the, uh, the day old bagels and slice them into bagel chips. And that's exactly what it looked like to me. But uh, I could see the advantage if you want to sample different spreads and different types of bagels, like at a party or something. But to walk down the street with a bagel that's cut up like that it seems pretty ridiculous. Well, I guess New Yorkers expect everything, especially when it comes to food, to be the best. We, we feel like we're the only city in the world sometimes. We, you know, there's nobody else. When I saw that image, it just looked wrong to me. Um, I think slicing it like that makes it too dainty and delicate, and it's a bagel. Uh, I've seen the photo. It seems weird to me, but I believe that we should all be free to slice our bagels as we wish. It's got to break down the way it tastes and everything. I mean, uh, the just consistency of it. You know, it's, it's going to be soft instead of hard. And, you know, it just seems horrible. Every bagel has a soft spot right there. So you go in a little, flip it, hands, fingers up. You'll never cut yourself that way. I would never think I was, when I started, I'd be still doing this. If someone came to you and said, I want a dozen bagels sliced like bread, what would, what would you say? <laughs> go, go down the block. <laughs> we, we, we wouldn't do it.